Okay, I promised to quote chapter and verse. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 44, verse 6. Thus saith the Lord, the King of Israel, and the Redeemer, the Lord of hosts, I am the first and I am the last, and beside me there is no God. Okay, let's go to Isaiah, mercy, chapter 49, verse whatever, uh, 12. Hearken unto me, O Jacob and Israel, my God, I am he. I am the first, I am also the last. I am he means Yahweh. That's the name of Almighty God in the Old Testament. Okay, now Jesus claimed to be the Alpha and the Omega. Verse 8. Oh, chapter, uh, book of <laughs> Revelation, chapter, uh, chapter 2, verse, eight, chapter 1, verse 8. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, and saith the Lord, which is and which was and which is to come, the Almighty. Chapter 11, uh, verse 11, saying, I am Alpha and Omega, the first and the last, and what thou seest, write in a book and send it unto the... So Jesus claimed to be the Alpha and the Omega, and the first and the last. That's what Alpha and Omega means in Greek, first and last. Almighty God claimed to be first and last, as we've seen in, in the Old Testament. Therefore, Jesus is Almighty God. 